All right, y'all, what's up everybody? For the divine feminine, no outside validation is required, okay? This is either you or your person, okay? Um, or shit, because some of y'all is gonna be someone that you work under, because look, we have a crown back here. Somebody's definitely being crowned, okay? Take that where it resonates, because we do have healer at the bottom of the deck. What's up, y'all? Thank you guys so much for all the love you continue to send. I definitely appreciate it and send it back, all right? Um, so they're ask so I feel like you've been mastering your mindfulness, like mastering your mind and your abilities. Um, so this is this is drawing more energy towards you at this time. And look, bam, we got divine masculine right here. So oh, this is a divine counterpart energy, but this is like this is two people walking in their purpose. So yeah. If you've been wondering what's coming, that's what's coming. Realizations. Ooh, P this divine masculine is having epiphanies about the divine feminine. Ooh. So there's a lot of understandings that are about to come to you about this connection. Somebody's light bulb just went off in their head because this divine masculine was being used as a pawn, as a chess piece in someone else's game. Or we'll see how this resonates. But anyway, remember this is collective. So take um only takes what resonates and leave the rest. Okay, let me see. Let's see, one more thing. Let me pull one more card for over here, okay? But uh, no outside validation is required. Trust me, I'm getting the energy of big boss energy. Like, if you guys are in separation with this masculine, baby, you are on fire. Like, y'all feel like Queen of Wands energy, but like Empress out too. I don't know. Let's see. What what do they need to know from this? Day? Let's see what's going on. What's going on here, Spirit? Thank you. Yeah, but this divine feminine is a healer, or this is the type of vibes that you give out. Either way, you've healed this divine masculine, or vice versa. And baby, bing, bing, bing. I'm seeing like fire, uh, firecrackers, self worth, bam. So that's what's going on here. You guys are both, y'all are both pulling in self worth. Okay. Um, I feel like that could be a bridge. That's gonna be the bridge between you and your divine masculine, or you and your divine feminine. Okay, take it where it resonates. Okay, um, this is very, yeah, expansion. Somebody's expanding their mind because you do have feminine and masculine energy within each human being, okay? Let's go ahead and get into it. Sorry, guys, 222. Okay. Yeah, so it's your destiny to think, to use your crown chakra to pull you through at this time, okay? Yeah. You got two purple cards. Your love is beginning. I feel like it's also self-love. Look, you got self-worth and self-love. I feel like with this self-worth, somebody came to the crossroads. You could have actually went to the crossroads and made an offering here. Um, but also, I definitely see just especially with the with the orange, it's giving uncrossing. Um, so I'm just going to I'm just going to channel real quick. So if this is you, you done came to the crossroads and they said, well, let, well, go and sit down. Stay a while. Because instead of just jumping in and out, it's like this is giving the energy of like sit a, sit and stay, like get into this energy. I don't know why this is taking a different turn, but let's just rock with me, y'all. So this type of this type of person who was like this person then came to the crossroads like, oh, yeah, I'm going to lead the offering. I'm going to just take the advice or whatever. But something's different about this one. There's a chair. Does that make sense? So it's like different energy. I feel like, for example, if you guys have split up or. You've come to your guides about this person before or your friends, family, whatever this is. You just, especially if you prayed this person out of your life or, or back into your life. It's just giving, stay a while. Because I just really feel like, especially if you're on your healer journey, you're going through a lot. I know spirit is kicking that ass. And spirit is also kicking their butt too. So I just feel like this divine masculine has to also understand what is their destiny. What... What are they feeling out of their heart, out of their crown chakra and also their heart space? Because love is beginning here. And I feel like, see, yeah, let's see what, what else is going on here. But this is great energy. Yeah, the will, the will is in your court. I mean, the ball is in your court. Hope is in reverse. I feel like they want to make things right. Somebody, I don't know, what's going on here? Because some of y'all are in separation and some of you aren't here. Hmm. But they know that you're part of their destiny now. They know that. I feel like they didn't close out a bunch of cycles. Yo, the solar plexus came out in reverse. I don't... Maybe... I feel like y'all just must not feel it for them anymore. Yeah, discontent and boredom. Yeah, oh. Okay. So you've gotten away from this person. Turned into a healer. Like, baby, you know... I, like, this person probably gaslighted you. Oh, 
So this is the so this is the person who pushed you into your spiritual ascension. Oh, well, if they're watching, hey, won't you learn you something? Because now they're realizing just how much you really meant what you said. This there is a seat that has been prepared for you in front of this motherfucker. And the bitch, that solar plexus is in reverse. You ain't got no love for them. You don't, I don't know. You probably don't even want to be their friend or nothing. I just feel like, see, it's a struggle though, because you're a healer. So you might even feel like bad for this person, but I don't know. They're good. I I just feel like this is the type of person who will just use it as an in to get back with you. And like, that's not what you guys want. I feel like you've moved on from that part of your life. Because you're real divine masculine, no ma'am, no sir. Um, This is very interesting energy here. Understandings. I feel like, yeah, so this is the type of person who you thought this was your person, but they turned out to be a karmic. Or they're just in karmic ways. Like, understand, when it's in the karmic energy, they can change this, but it's up to them. No, you know, you could take the person to a water, but you can't make them drink with the four of wands here. And we got the foundation and achievements. This person has to want the foundation for themselves. They got to touch the, the soil themselves. They have to want to... See, that's that's also marriage and like stability. So I feel like you really learned a lot about this person. And whatever you do with this person is up to you. But I just feel like they now feel like they missed out. But they wanted you to miss out. Right after you left this person, that's when your healer abilities went all the way up. Because you realized you didn't need no outside. This was the only person holding you up. So at the end of the day, of course, it's our own. Like, we we control ourselves. But I'm saying, this is the type of person who you cared about them. You thought they was your person. You trusted them. So you trusted what they said. And you probably caught them. Or there was just certain... Even if you gave them business ideas or just, like, ideas. Maybe they didn't listen to you. Like, maybe this is the type of person who bullies everybody else over you. Like, what? Okay, tell, tell us about this Divine Masculine. Who is the Divine Masculine? I know they know they missed the fuck out. They missed out and they feel some type of way. Yep, the waiting game. They kept you waiting and then they made the wrong choice. They went towards the passionate, like, see, they went towards the passion and not the love. They really did not think their way through this. And this is why they're getting karma right now. Because they should have never played with you. See, they could have kept it honest with you too. This is a this is just someone who they didn't really know what type of energy they were in, but they know now. Child, what you done did to this person? You must have had a serious glow up away from them because they probably thought you didn't have a pot to piss in. Suffering in silence. Wow. They are suffering. Look, they are mad. They're like, oh my God, the collective is over me? Oh my God. They thought this was going to be a forever game. See, and now they done learned about See, when they learn about what soulmates and stuff are too, then they really get to plan. That narcissist really will pop out then. But uh, what's going on with this for? Uh, discontent and boredom, please. Yeah, you're bored with this connection. You're like, nah, I'm, I'm good. Look, third eye. You're like, I'm good. You don't want to play the guessing game no more. It's like, why do you always have to go there? Like, anyway, with this type of person, this type of person who thinks you're slow. Because they're fucking slow. They can't get no sleep at night. Your ancestors is probably whooping their ass. And they should be. I mean, what do you want me to say? This is what they get. They brought this on themselves. Because they didn't see this. See, now they're a divine masculine. But where the fuck, where they ass was at, dog? When You feel me? Where they was at? I just want to know. You know what I mean? Like, for real. Because they had a choice between you and someone else. And they chose the wrong path. Right here, you got waiting game with destiny. They kept you waiting. You were pouring into the... Let me get into this. Let me get into their ass real quick. Because look how you poured into them. You see that motherfucking tree inside there? Y'all probably, you know, burnt, you know, smoke some tree together, if you know what I mean. You really... You you helped this person with their roots. You even probably taught them about the culture, child, all of that. But they always left you on red or always left you on scene, whatever the fuck, because their third eye... See, my left ear is... Wait, see... My left eye air is, is like really going crazy right now because that's how this person is feeling like everything you try to tell them, bitch, is coming true. And they don't know what the fuck. They're feeling spooked out. It's getting spooky around this bitch. It getting spooky around this bitch. It getting real spooky. You see that shadow? You see that devil car? It getting real spooky. It gets real spooky around these parts because you tried to tell the ass. 
but they always think it's a game until it's not a game no more. This is funny. Look, heartache and loss. They don't know. Okay. They done got trapped by their own shadow. They done fed the shadow. See, this is, you know, like with the with birds outside and they say don't feed the birds. It's like this person fed their shadow so much unknowingly. Now they're shadowed and put them, looked and wrapped them up. She looked like she's in a belt, like wrapped up, bitch. Wow. Your crown chakra has been lit up and up, but this is why you you get everything is like everything you turn you touch turns to gold. You're very much in your artistic bag right now because this is part of your this is part of your destiny, your Akashic records. Let's see what else out of this deck. Anything else? Thank you. Movement choices. Yeah, this person had a choice because I feel like so this is the type of person who who has too many responsibilities and they don't know how to juggle everything. So they must be looking at you like, how to freak do you do it? They don't know how you do it because they move around. This is what they do. They move around a lot and they get themselves involved in a lot of different side hustles and jobs and business ventures. Side chicks too with the two of pentacles, okay? But, and, and side dudes, but I digress. Anyway, so they move around so much to avoid their responsibility. Like jack of all trade, master of none. You know what I'm trying to say, guys? Because look, they got commitment, money, commitment, and growing food and and the spirit you see what i'm saying they got a choice and they always choose the same one but now you're done with that they don't know what the fuck to do bitch Ooh, they want a spiritual union with you though now they want to take do what it takes but that's up to y'all i also feel like this is with your business ventures as well this is not just lovers here clarify the uh movement choices and decisions please thank you Please clarify. Thank you so much, Fear. Please clarify movement choices, decisions for us. Thank you. Moving on. Moving choices. Look. Movement choices and decisions, baby. You're like, time is up. You done moved on. Some of you guys picked your stuff up and actually moved out of the house. Or just you just not answering your phone no more because you're done with this person gaslighting you. Good. And ciao. Well, you're a big healer. So I want to know more about this healer. Let's see. What's going on? Let's see. Let's clear the energy. Let's get this healer. What's going on with our healer, child? Because I know that your self-esteem is all the way up there. And this is what this person is recognizing about you. They don't know how to take it here. Mater Ooh, material and spiritual prosperity. Positive moving forward. Are you serious, bitch? You're sailing away. You're like, Froop. You're, 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 you worked hard to get here and you continue to work hard because you asked yourself those hard questions. You're like, you got to the point where you were just like, you know what? I could keep avoiding, I could keep coming here doing the same old thing, but you're like past that now. You're like, I need to know the, the nitty gritty. Like I need to be able to do something on my own. So you didn't took it to the next level. I just feel like you push yourself to the next level. Like good is the enemy of great. That is a book, by the way, that you could also read. Okay. Tell, let's talk, let's talk about this divine feminine over here. Let's get into her. Now we didn't see, and they got the realization that you find is one, but yeah, somebody just had their court, their 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 coronation, their crowning. Congratulations! What's going on with this divine feminine? Or this is what's happening. Pay attention to your dreams. Listen, if y'all need a reading, hit me up. New beginnings. Come on now. Shout out to you. So it's heavy initiation vibes, heavy matriarch vibes. Somebody's passing you the torch. Somebody's learning a brand new skill. Somebody just got that job. Like you feel light. Whatever this is, bitch, it's lightness. Like, bitch, it feels like all your worries are disappeared. Okay. You are literally walking on top of the world. And the way that she's walking out of this door is like coming out, coming out. Come on now. I keep seeing Akashic records, but it's not just, it's like, bitch, what's up? Going through a portal. Like. You're seeing things from a whole new perspective. The world is, your energy is bigger than just the world. I don't know how to explain. Well, you're, you're just bigger than that. I feel like you, they, you, because you don't got to the place where you were like, bro, like I got nowhere else to go but up. And baby, up did you go? Amen. Bitch, they don't know what to do. I feel like you took amazing leap forward. Like people can't even hear from you right now. Like you are so in the astral plane at this time. They are at a loss of words. See, this is where they left you. They thought they left you ga gagged and bound. No, they didn't know what time it was, but they learned today. They learned today. They learned what this firm foundation was about today, though. That's what they learned about. 
Okay. What's going on with this new beginnings with the healer? Thank you, Spirit. Ooh. So, yeah. So, Spirit has offered you a new opportunity if you want to take it. Yes. Look. With your shadow side and love begin. Look at that. Temperance. Look at that. Come on now. Because you have a balance between your shadow side. This is why you're allowed to move forward now. This is why. Because you face the dark parts of yourself and you're prepared to keep doing so. Material and spiritual prosperity, baby. Keep going, okay? Bitch. And these people know that you'll knock some shit out too in the spirit and the regular. Like, they know that you don't play. Like, they know that you're a healer, but don't play with me. Because, I like, come on now. There's two sides of the game. Yin and yang. You see how it's the... the you see? Two different colors of the same person. So they learn that about you the hard way. What you been doing to these people? Oh, yeah. Because you look them face to face. Like, I, you know, this is them trying to walk in. Look at them. They, they see you in the astral world and they just keep going because they're like, you know what? That person looks like I don't want to mess with. You know, that person is actually talking. They're over here talking to their shadow. Yeah, that motherfucker. Yeah, let me not mess with them. That's what they're saying about you. Okay, talk to us about the shadow card here for the healer. But you had to go through this. You had to really face the deep, dark depths of your spirit. Like you can, uh -huh. And the divine masculine is really looking at you shaking in their boots. Because like, bitch, they thought it was a game before. And so now they're going through their own dark night of the soul. They're looking at you like, bitch, you make this shit look like cakewalks. I know because it's my death. I didn't even see this at the bottom, but I just had faith that spirit would have us have our back. And they do. Thank you, spirit. As usual, it's your destiny. Yes. Base chakra, like, bitch, come on. See what's going on with the shadow yeah but you have to see and now you you've started off fresh with your shadow side now you're no longer ashamed of it now you're no longer keeping it locked up and hidden look at that you're no longer keeping your shadow side trapped anymore because you've talked it out now you figured out how to maneuver your way through the the obstacles because no weapon formed against you shall, shall prosper i mean they're gonna form but they're not gonna they're not gonna touch you financial and material changes after patience and planning, you got through that. Yeah. So whatever mental fog, that's I rebuke that. I definitely rebuke that, period. Bind you up and send you back into the abyss times a thousand. Okay, we bind the spirit of doubt up. Bye bye. You have no place here. See, because they were banking on the fact that you were going to stay trapped in your head. They thought you, yeah, because maybe you were overthinking or, or whatever before. But bitch, that's because you didn't know who you were. Wow. See, these people definitely sabotage you on purpose, but they don't even know that that's what they were doing, child. They thought in their head, this is what happened. The enemy told them something else in their head, meaning like they heard quote unquote thoughts that they thought they were just thinking on their own. No, they weren't. They were just, it was abstract thoughts to lead them to feel a certain way about you and then try to rain on your parade, if that makes sense. Like I said, if y'all need a personal, we definitely get deep into these type of situations. It's easier when it's one-on-one. -on -one. But yeah, and this is a collective. So, I mean, everybody's situation is different. But you know what I'm talking about, though? It's just like, it's like exercising. Like, you know, pull it back and forth. Like, you really got to make that shit happen. This is the type of person that you have to tug and tug and tug with. Now, all of a sudden, like, now all of a sudden, they have this big-ass light bulb. Like, now they're, they want to blow you up. Like, because you're the, they want to blow you up. Like, oh, please talk to me. Help me through this. No. The fuck is you talking about? block fuck is wrong with you this per like uh-uh it, it getting a little that's what i'm saying so they don't got a taste of it themselves child now they're stuck in fear bitch they can't get out they're like what is going on james collective please help me out and you're like bitch i'm over here doing my healer like what like i said now this like oh i should have said in the beginning this is i hope y'all already know if you if you watch this part if you watch this far then I already know that you know this isn't just for love. I haven't even decided. Spirit hasn't really told me what page I'm going to post this reading on yet. I'm not really sure you at this point. So if you see this video, you're being led to follow all three of the pages that all three of my pages. It's just for, you know, only if you're led because they're different for different things. But Spirit will show me where to download that. Anyway, back to the topic. So it's like. They're being faced with the fact that they sold. Oh. 
Hold on a second. <gasps> Spirit. Oh my God. Oh my God. I was about to say they're dealing with the fact that they sold their soul. Oh my God. Look at that picture. Look at that. Look at how there's a cutout of his head. Okay. Well, thank you for the confirmation, Spirit. This person sold part of their soul. I'm about to write that down because that needs to go in the title. Well, I, I, I don't want to break the circle, so I'm going to stay right here. But listen. Wow. <laughs> there it is. We're down to the bottom of it. 20 minutes in. We're down to the This has been the energy for a minute. This motherfucker has written. Oh. Okay. So this person realizes that they sold a piece. They realize that they, I, I'm, I'm going to go as far as to say unknowingly, some of them unknowingly, some of them they know, but there is a, a large chunk of them who were bamboozled into selling their soul. I'm not going to lie. And it was part of it. That's how they were able to get away with it. And it could just be for a contract. It could be for a, a certain amount of time, but I definitely see that. And they're wanting to call you. They're wanting to blow you up because they want you to heal them. So now the love is that they feel for you, whether these are old friends, old lovers, old coven members, it's a new type of level because now they feel like you have the medicine they need. They feel like you have the healing they need. So it just starts to become, oh my God, no. I feel like this person is, is very patient and they're, okay. I don't want to talk about that, but I do know this. Throw chakra. Well, shit. Spirit said, talk about it. Okay. Well, all right. Fine. Thank you, Spirit. I'll go ahead and talk about it. Um. So this person is plotting and planning on you. Like they're definitely patiently pl planning. This is someone. This could be like from seven. Let's see. What, like seven months ago? Something could have happened like seven months ago. And this person could be wanting to retaliate now. I don't know. That's for some of you guys. But I do see that they've been. Choose wisely. Okay, so this person has different like mantras on their like in their hand. So it's like they have different energies. Look at that. Look. Okay, so you see there's two two. Okay, it was twenty two four four. It was two two four four. Wow, okay, thank you. You see how the hand is, is going towards this one bird, but then it's just passing the other bird. You see that? It's just missing it barely. This is that person. Even though they're getting, even though they're they're getting their shit together, they just they're still not permitted to be back into your energy, because I don't know what they did to you guys, but they really left you hanging. Like, but this was you. You was praying the whole time, but your spirit team heard you. Your shadow side is reminding you all the dark nights that you had with ever with with dealing with this energy. emotional withdrawal like i said people do change so just make sure but this person is in a contract we need to get them out if you before you do anything with them you got to get that they have to get themselves out of that damn contract what's going on with this mental conflict child what is this thank you you see they have to pay because they had you in a mental conflict shit they could have had you in a contract before look at that asa um pentacles though prosperity begins Oh my gosh, so they planted seeds based off of your fucking energy, child. And they put intentions out to the universe using your energetic stamp. Oh, wow. And they were able to keep going for a while, but they thought they would never get caught. Oh, stupid ass. Ooh-wee. Okay, clarify mental conflict, please. I know I didn't ask already, but let's clarify. Thank you, spirit. This is getting real juicy. Mental conflict, mental conflict. Chow. Yeah. Oh my God. So they sold, they sold part of their soul to be with somebody else. They thought the grass was greener on the other side, or this is some, it's either their person or their friends that they were listening to. But I feel like it's both. They really don't want this to be seen. I feel like your ancestors are like, no, they don't want you with this person. They don't want you tied up nowhere near that person. Okay, well, they put you in a third party or they just were always breaking your heart. And this is why they, they're not allowed to close back to you. 
conflict and defeat. Yeah, because they really just wanted to. This was them always pushing you in the pushing you down. Like when the going got tough, mm -mm. kept you waiting. Uh uh. Nope. But you overcame the conflict and defeat. They were really sent to harm you. Like this, some for some of you guys, this could have been an actual abusive relationship. Like mentally, physically, spiritually, people could have been doing like actually putting their hands on you. I rebuke that. Okay. Yeah, that's the truth though. Look, that's the truth though for some of y'all. Um, but they also could have been doing like sex magic on you without asking you. Like that's that's crazy. Monitoring spirits and all that. That shit is wild and crazy and it's not normal. I'm definitely not trying to offend nobody, but if that if that offends anybody on here, then come talk to me because I get it. That just means you just need a little cleaning up. I'm not here to blame you. Who am I to fucking blame anybody? But hear me what I just said. If me mentioning monitoring spirits and binding to each other without knowledge and B-L-O-O-D magic and S-E-X, all that, if any of that bothers you, hit me up. Let's have a conversation because you probably just need some cleansing. You need a little healing. We can learn from each other. I'm not judging. I'm just saying anything against someone's free will, like knowingly. And I know people have different ideas on that. I'm not, well, if you want to talk like, but I'm just like, you can either, you can argue with yourself. I'm talking about those of you who were taught wrong. There are people out here who do, who, there are people who, who are okay with this. You see, that's why we wouldn't be having these conversations if there weren't people out here like this. So I'm just trying to let you know if this is you, okay, because you're meant to be a healer. So you just have to understand that. I feel like you guys already know that, but I'm just saying. It's never too late to change. You just have to want to change. So yeah, if, if somebody knows that something has been a little bit weird when it comes to their job, their 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 money, their friends, their purpose, anything, we can have a reading. The link it will be below. And my pricing is right there when you click the link. Okay? Or email me and I'll send it to you. Okay? What's going on with the shadow? Because you know, the universe started from darkness. Okay. Clarify shadow. Please, thank you, spirit. Thank you. Okay, hope. Yeah. So there's a lot of hope being brought into the into the mix. Okay. Star energy. This is what pushed you. Yeah, bitch. Some of you guys are really like, yeah, look at that. Rest and rejoice. You guys are solid um meditators. Meditating is really that is really what 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 gets shit done. But you see, look. In, in the shadow, you found yourself. Because look, there's a person right here. Light and dark. Sun and moon. Okay. And new beginnings, please. Thank you. Passion has been ignited. So look, you're, you're on the right path. You just had to open up your heart space. Healer. Love is beginning. Bitch, this is your exes. This is anybody who tried to play with you. Okay, love you.